Hi, it's Dougie Wood, and in this episode of our series on Microsoft Teams tips, I'm going to show you how you can embed a website directly into a Microsoft Team tab. So open up your Microsoft Teams application and go to the team uh, where you want to add this tab. So I'm inside my Project X team, and you can see by default I've got Posts, Files, and Wiki as my tabs, but you can also add more tabs across the top. The reason why you might want to add more tabs is that you can quickly access websites, applications, um, documents that are going to be useful to that particular team. So you can almost create this kind of one-stop shop that everything your team members need to access is all in one place. So if I click on this plus button here, I can see all the different types of tabs that I could possibly add to my Microsoft team. You've got things like um, wikis, Excel, OneNotes, stream videos, um, PowerPoints, uh, forms. There's all sorts of different things that you could embed directly onto here. Um, and actually scrolling through, it's worth taking a little look because there's all sorts of third party applications which natively integrate directly into Microsoft Teams as a tab. So if you can't find um, within this list what you're looking for to integrate directly, you can always use um, this website option, which as long as you've got a URL um, or like basically a hyperlink, you'll be able to navigate directly um, to that website from this tab. So all you need to do is give the tab a name. So let's just say, for example, we're going to do Google. Then I'm going to paste in or type in the URL that I want to, to post in. And then I've got the option of whether or not I want to post this into my channel to, to let people know that they've added this tab. Um, once I'm then happy with all of that, I click on save. And that's then going to add my tab. See, so it's now added this Google tab. Um, and I'm searching now within Google uh, without ever having to leave my Microsoft team. And this will work for the same for any um, sort of website or web page that you have um, that you want to have a URL um, to add across the top. So this is how we've embedded a uh, website directly into our Microsoft team using a tab across the top. However, we can also embed other things as well, as I was saying. So we could do it with a file, let's say, for example, like an Excel file. So let's say, for example, my team rotor that I've got stored inside of my Microsoft team that I've already uploaded into my files area. I'm going to select that, click on Save, and then I've added my team rotor. Now, by default, I should have changed the name here. And you can do that by clicking on the drop down, click on Rename, and then let's just call this our rotor. So now you can see... Not only have I got my default tabs in terms of my conversations inside of posts, my documents inside of files, my kind of useful content and knowledge inside of my wiki, um, I've also got links directly to external websites such as Google, as well as my team rotor across the top. I hope you found that video useful. If you did, please do like and subscribe to the channel. And if you've got any thoughts or comments about Microsoft Teams, please let me know in the comments feed below.